every year this conference is getting more global. I'd uh, recommend to come to the conference. Also, it lets you analyse your business and look at it in a different light, which you, know, you don't tend to do at the farm gate. Stimulating. It's a sort of a time of year when the streets of Oxford are filled with farmers. Very good, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I came with a very much an open mind. I've been to a conference before. Certainly been a good selection of speakers. It is a fabulous programme to get the Secretary of State and the European Commissioner and the likes of Jonathan Porritt and Paul Judge in the debate. The lineup looks incredible. Well, good morning everyone. I've been really looking forward to the Oxford Farming Conference. It's my first as Secretary of State. It's really, uh, really my, my pleasure and my visit is in, uh, to have this direct contact with the farmers. I think it's really important that young people have a part to play in the Oxford Farming Conference. If we want to put our points across, here's the place to say it, and it may get recognised at the top level. It's a chance for the audience to challenge the politicians for a change, which I think will be a good thing. This evening we've got Radio 4's John Humphreys coming along. I was a mind-numbingly incompetent, ignorant dairy farmer who thought it was going to be easy and discovered it wasn't. I've been very interested to come to the conference. I've found the technological um, arguments very, very persuasive. Talking about the GM issues, it's all very relevant. We are empowered to get the best deal we can for UK farmers, consumers, taxpayers and the environment. On the first day when we heard a lot of the politics, that forms a good background to the second day where we, we get deeper into the technology some hope for the future.